Think you don't have time to create hundreds of Etsy listings? Think again. Let me show you the secret behind how top Etsy shops rack up thousands of sales and how you can do the same with just a fraction of the time. Successful shops don't just have 40 or 50 listings. They've got hundreds, even thousands. But here's the kicker. Many of them created twice as many listings as you see now, testing and tweaking until they found what clicks with their customers. Ready to unlock the secrets to skyrocket your own sales? Let's jump in and break it down. Quick question. How many listings do you currently have in your Etsy shop? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear. I know what you're thinking. How can I possibly post that many listings when I've only got a few hours a week with work and family? In this video, I'm going to show you how to create 100 designs in a day using just Canva and ChatGPT. Number one, first, we'll find a great scalable design to create. A scalable design is a template you can reuse by just changing the words, allowing you to quickly make multiple designs. In step two, we'll jump into Canva to create the template. And finally, in step three, I'll show you how to bulk create your designs like a pro all within Canva. Let's kick things off with step one, finding down a killer scalable design. For this example, we'll focus on professions, but don't stop there. You can easily swap in hobbies, sports, or even locations to create endless variations. Ready to find the perfect design formula? Let's get started. Quick question, if you could create any type of design for your shop, what topic would it be? I'd love to hear. Looking for a creative way to spark new ideas? Let AI do this. If you haven't tried ChatGPT yet, head over to chat.openai.com and create an account. Here's what I did. I asked it, give me 50 professions that are popular so I can put them on a shirt. Boom. It gave me a massive list to work with. But hold up, don't stop there. Next, we'll hop over to Etsy to make sure there's actual demand for your niche. You can create something with no current demand, but I prefer designing for things people are already searching for on Etsy. This way, you're selling what people want. Now we have a list of 50 professions to start with, but you can also ask ChatGPT for vacation spots, hobbies, or anything else to get ideas for research. So let's take number five, for example. Let's take lawyer. Go to Etsy and type in the niche you're selling, like lawyer shirt in this example. Let's see what's selling hot. Start by using the filters, hit the star seller filter. Now boom, over 1000 results pop up for best selling lawyer items. Sure, not all are shirts, but you'll spot some seriously popular designs. Ready to find your winners? Let's go. For example, Here's a popular design. It's me. Hi, I am the lawyer. So it looks like there definitely is demand for this particular niche. And we want to look for a good way to scale out this design and others. A great idea is the don't make me use my lawyer voice design. You could easily swap lawyer with other professions and have a winning design since we know it's selling well in this niche. I'll use this design for the example, but remember, put your own twist on it. There are endless possibilities. I encourage you to find a different saying so your design is unique. Now for step two, creating your scalable design. A quick and easy method is using simple text only designs, but combining two different fonts for more interest rather than just one blocky font. You can save time by not looking for 20 or 30 minutes for two fonts that look good together is by searching for font duos. For fonts, I recommend 1001fonts.com because choosing the right pair of fonts can make or break your design. Go to the 1001 fonts site to find plenty of great fonts that come in pairs, perfect for your designs. For example, this Jaiho font looks perfect and you can use this as a free font. For paid fonts, you can search Creative Fabrica and explore their website. If you found this tutorial useful so far, give it a thumbs up and join our community by subscribing for more no-nonsense tutorials. Now let's head to Canva to create our design. Click Create a design in the top left. Set a custom size and I'll enter 4,500 by 5,400. Since this is a good rectangle size for a t-shirt design, this will open a new canvas for us to design in. To add the font, press the T button to bring up paragraph text. Click on the text box where it says Canvas Sans. Choose the font you want. For example, I choose HK Modular. Make sure to edit its size. I'll make it larger and move it to the top, considering how it will fit on the t-shirt across the chest. After that, I'll copy this text because I want the next part to be in cursive. Here, select the mama font. In this example, it was good lawyer 
and we'll change this to the cursive version. Then this adds a fun handwritten style compared to the blocky look of the other font. I'll copy it and bring it down here. You can keep this all black and use it on various shirt colors. However, we'll be editing the good lawyer line and you can't alternate colors like you can with many other designs. The part your bulk editing needs to be a solid color, so keep that in mind. Now that we've added a fun look, let's create the document to scale out this design. This is where the magic happens. Go back to ChatGPT and copy all the ideas it gave you for your design. Then head to Google Sheets and start a new blank document. Here, we'll create a document to guide Canva on bulk uploading our designs. I'll paste in our list of 50 professions. You'll want to review and decide if you want to create each one and ensure there's demand for your design template. Then adjust the words based on your design. For my example, I want it to say, good lawyer, good doctor, and good engineer, etc. So I need to add the word good before each of these terms. Once you've prepared your document with the words you want to replace in your design, go to file, then download, and select CSV file to save it to your computer. This brings us to step three, bulk creating your designs in Canva. Here's where the real magic begins. And don't worry, it's simpler than it looks. First, select the word you want to replace, which in my case is good lawyer, and then go down to bulk create. Go to the app section on the left and type in bulk create. Click bulk create. You can either enter the data manually or upload the CSV file you just created. After uploading, right click on the words you want to replace and select connect data. You should now see the file we just uploaded starting with good doctor, which was the first line. Click on continue and now select yes to generate all 49 pages. Wow, look at that super cute 50 designs that it just created. Now just go to share, select download, choose transparent background and download all 49 pages. And just that quick, I have that many gorgeous designs, but you do want to scroll through each one to make sure that they make sense as sometimes things are longer and don't fit on one line. So sometimes you'll have to edit these slightly find another scalable design for those same professions and boom, you're on your way to 100 designs in no time. The best part, you can reuse the same skills, titles and tags across different designs for each profession. For example, you can create one title and tags for the doctor design and use those for both designs. If you found this helpful, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe for more no fluff tutorials on Etsy, print on demand and AI hacks. You don't want to miss the next one. It's a game changer.